Hello students, this is Muhammad Javed, lecturer in Mathematics, International Maritime College. This video is about imperial units and conversion of units of temperature. First of all, what are imperial units? They are the old units used by the British Empire yard, which are which is represented by yd foot which is represented by one bar inch one two bar one pound is written as one lb one ounce is written as oz now conversion of imperial units among themselves one foot has caught 12 inches one gallon has called uh, has got eight point pence and one mile is seventeen hundred and sixty yards and one pound equals sixteen ounce one yard has got three feet so on the right side they are conversion among the imperial units they are the conversion and they are short representation yard foot inch pound ounce this is foot to inches gallon to pent miles to yard pound to ounce and yard to feet Now, uh, some example, but before example, I'm going to put uh, the conversion in front of me so that we could see it easily. See them easily. Convert one eight feet and two inches. We know that one, f uh, first of all, eight, eight, and one foot has got. 12 inches so we multiply this by 12 and it will be converted into uh, 12 16 96 inches this is the notation another example 10 yards and 2 feet so First of all, we write 10, and you could remember from here that one yard has got three feet, so multiply by three, and it will be converted into 30 feet. Fit is this rotation 21 pence and two gallon. Now take care if we are going to convert pent into gallon and pent is a small unit so here we can find we if we divide this by 8 and this by 8 so it means one pent equal to 1 by 8 gallon so simply to say we are going to divide gallon by 8 so first of all we need to write 21 because we are converting 21 and multiply 1 by 8 so by doing this 21 divided by 8 so 8 to the 16 point then there is 3, 8, 3, there are 24, and so on, gallon. Some 2, 3 digits will be there more. Another example 32 ohms into pound. So, ohms is a small unit because 1 pound has got 16 ohms. So, divide by 16. So first of all, let's calculate ohms. And 16 so it mean 1 ohms 
equal to 1 by 16 pound so as so first of all we are writing 32 times now we finish us by this 1 by 16 and it comes out 2 pound LV some temperature units always uh, also here how to convert Celsius scale to Fahrenheit scale this is the rule so if you are given Celsius scale C means Celsius scale we plug in Celsius value here and the new result will give us Fahrenheit value for example 72 so here we put 72 so 9 by 5 times uh, 75 plus 32 okay now they, this is multiplication so that means we can divide 75 by 5 so 9 and 5 of the 5 uh, 7 the plus 32 and then 63 and 153 will come plus 32 and equals 1 8 5 so this is for a high temperature we convert it 32 degree Celsius into 185 degree Fahrenheit now what if we convert Fahrenheit into Celsius okay Fahrenheit into Celsius so this time we have actually this formula is uh, they are interchangeable they are the same formula uh, if you need Fahrenheit so you convert this into this formula if you need to convert into Celsius then you write, use this formula the formula is same it's just conversion okay the question is 194 degree Fahrenheit so here we will plug in 194 so 5 by 9 into 194 minus 32 first of all break it so 5 by 9 Then subtraction one six two. This can be cancelled now by nine and five. Multiply uh, nine on the nine. We will be left with eight. So eight eighteen after division. And I think. 540 so the temperature is now in centigrade 90 degree centigrade I hope this short video will help us in the conver conversion of some imperial units and these temperature units thank you